Also, this Democratic Congresswoman Alyssa Slotkin of Michigan has launched a new Senate bid for Debbie Stabenow's seat that will be vacant when she retires in 2024. She's out with a new ad this morning. This is why I'm running for the United States Senate. We need a new generation of leaders that thinks differently, works harder, and never forgets that we are public servants. Look, our country is going to get through this. It's hard work, but that's what Michiganders do. We need engaged citizens and principled leaders because together, there is no problem we cannot solve. John Lemire, your thoughts on her candidacy? She's got a pretty um, impressive background. That she does, uh, and a compelling message so far. She, of course, a veteran uh, and worked in the intelligence agencies. Uh, so far, though, it's interesting. This is an open seat, as we were just talking about with a state senator a short time ago. Uh, but so far, more potential candidates are opting against the bid than jumping in, potentially helping uh, Congresswoman Slotkin's efforts. We have a number of folks who have said they won't do so. Governor Whitmer has said that she's not going to mm -hmm. chase uh, this. Uh, Congressman uh, James is also, as well as the lieutenant governor, all passing on bids at this moment. So there will certainly be others for this open seat vacated by Debbie Stabenow, the longtime senator there in Michigan, um, and a state that, as we've been talking about, has gone bluer, more Democrat in recent years, though certainly will remain a key battleground next November. For sure. Coming up.